Hey guys, thank you so much for joining me today. I'm gonna to show you guys a really quick and easy way to achieve a sunset eye and a really natural face using just very few products that you can wear with your mask and you can really, really show off. So I'm gonna go ahead and start with the Bare Minerals Original Liquid Mineral Foundation. This is a incredible foundation. It's uh, been inspired by our original loose powder foundation and it's 88% derived natural ingredients. And it's just honestly one of the most amazing foundations. It's so easy to use, it's effortless and it feels so beautiful. So let me show you guys how to use it. So you wanna always wake up your makeup and this particular foundation has medium coverage, so just so you know, you don't need very much. And so when you wake it up, what you wanna do is twist it up and do two, maybe one pump, depending on the size of your mask. You want to dot it in the areas that you need a little extra coverage. And what's really great about this is, I mean, I put two pumps and you see, I, I really don't need more than that. Now I've dotted it, so now I need to sweep it. So I'm gonna just take it slowly by using my middle finger and my ring finger, just to really be as natural and light-handed as possible. And then I'm gonna press in the product. So once I've kind of sweeped it across the areas I need it, all I need to do is press it. And the color I'm wearing is medium tan 18. And this color works really well for my skin tone. I have vitiligo, so I need some warming up in certain areas. So this has worked really well for my skin color, my skin tone, and everything else. So I'm going to sweep again, and then I'm going to press. And you can just see it leaves such a luminescent, beautiful finish on the skin. It's really clean. It doesn't feel like you're wearing makeup all day. And honestly, I find I don't really need to touch up. So you can really just see how well it's glowing and still showing my natural skin so it doesn't look heavy. And if I do want extra coverage, I can absolutely add more in areas I feel like I need more coverage. My skin feels really, really beautiful, really light and really dewy and fresh. I don't feel like I'm wearing any makeup and I use very little product. So I'm gonna go in now with a really light translucent powder. Um, it's a pore minimizer and it's just a really beautiful loose powder. It's the Mineral Veil. And what's really great about this powder is that it does not cast any sort of white translucent of any sort. It's so natural. It's so, so delightful to wear and it doesn't feel heavy in any way. Not everybody loves using brushes, I do. Um, for my foundation, I love using my hands. For my concealer, I love using my hands. But when it comes to the Mineral Veil, I love to just take a little bit on this beautiful brush. It's the Diffuse Highlight Brush, and you can see how little I'm gonna actually take. And what I like to do is take it into the base of the cap, and what this is gonna do is just take any excess powder off. Um, this is like a nice way just to kind of save yourself the product without having any um, thick areas on your brush. So what I'm gonna do is go into my T-zone where I tend to get just a little extra shine, and under my eyes just to set any extra makeup that um, does it need to absorb heat through the day? And I'm gonna just go under here where I might get a little shiny. As you can see, it really just took down the shine in really the areas that are high points of shine. So that's all I need and want and I'm looking for usually in my face powder and my face makeup. So this is a perfect combination for me. Um, on the super, super cold winter days, I wasn't even using a powder because I feel like this is enough. So. I hope you guys like how this feels, because I do. All right, next, let's go to eyes. All right, so now that we've finished our skin, I'm gonna go in for my eyes with the Bare Minerals. This is the Bounce and Blur in Dawn, and this is such a beautiful palette. Just please take a look, everyone. Look at that, beautiful. And these are such unique shadows because they almost like bounce when you touch them. Um, you don't need a brush, you can use your fingers. They blend really well, and they're also very buildable, so you have a lot of options with these. Um, they're really, really pigmented, and they're just really lovely shadows, so let's give it a go. I'm gonna start by applying this lighter shade right here. This one is called Pink Cloud, and I'm going to take my middle finger you can just see how pretty that is and I'm just going to go on my lid just to give it kind of like a bright pop of opening just in the front and then I can go over and then like around this would be really pretty even here yeah so pretty and then let's do the other eye and I can't stop staring at my skin you guys look at it it's so dewy just one beautiful coat of that foundation and my skin looks gorgeous. All right, so that is with Pink Cloud. 
how pretty, just like a nice little brightening shadow. So next I'm gonna go in with something just a little bit warmer. I'm gonna use Misty Mornings. And this color is definitely a little bit warmer. And I'm just going to warm up my outer corner. And this is such a grab and go palette for me. It's so easy to use and every product kind of goes with Bare Minerals in general, every product kind of goes, you can use it in so many ways, which I love. So I'm just going to even this out. And again, I'm just using my finger with this beautiful tone and no brush needed. Just a nice good blend with your finger. And you don't need a whole lot. So that's just like a really soft, clean, simple eye. And if I really wanted to go crazy, I could take a little bit of the darker shade right here, which is Hazy Taupe, and just go onto my lash line and see how it just sort of warmed it up as if I'm wearing eyeliner. It's just a nice way to transition and you don't get any harsh lines and it just easily warms up right where you want it to warm up. So for me, this is such a easy go-to quick eye, especially with a mask. It's just really simple and it doesn't look like you're wearing a lot. So I love this palette. Look at what a great easy eye I just did in literally seconds. And I use three colors, but just one hand. Okay, so now that our eyes are done, I just wanna put a beautiful pop of mascara on and I'm gonna use my favorite strength and length mascara. Um, the most unique mascara in the market. It's got this really unique paddle brush that basically you paint your lashes on with the applicator from the very, very base of your lash all the way up. And then you have all these divots of all these little spikes all throughout. And that's going to separate, lengthen, and kind of darken and plump up all your lashes. And it also has a built-in serum. So you're not only gonna get an amazing look immediately, but you're also putting something on your eyes that will help promote lash growth. So that's what I love about this the most. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just applying it from the base, this part right here, and I'm just painting on the color basically. And this mascara is so incredible because you'll see with just one coat, it's to die for. So now that I've just applied, that's literally just applying the color on the flat, the flattened base right here. And then I'm going to go in with the spikes. And you are able to get so close to the root of each lash, which is why it looks so dark, so separated and so beautiful. And that's what all these little spikes do for you. They get every little nook and cranny. They get all of the fronts, all the backs, all the sides, any hidden little lash that you don't even see it gets. So that's literally just one coat, you guys. And then I'm gonna go and use one side of the spikes just on my bottoms because I'm a bottom lash girl. I love bottom mascara. It's a all-time favesies. And it's not for everyone, but it is for me. So I love this mascara because I'm able to really, really use it in so many ways. Isn't that beautiful? One coat, literally one coat, unreal. All right, so now that my mascara is done, my complexion's done and my eyeshadow's done, I'm gonna use the Strength and Length Brow Gel, another personal favorite of mine. Um, this also has a built-in serum, so it's going to promote lash and eyebrow growth as well. And it comes in clear as well as three other shades. I'm going to be using the shade Coffee. Uh, just to warm up my brows a little bit. My brows are pretty full anyways, so I don't usually don't need a whole lot. Um, I use the clear one at night before bed to help my lashes and my, not my lashes, my brows grow at night while I'm sleeping. Um, I, I can't tell you what a difference I've seen. And I use the coffee in the daytime just to add that extra pop of brow. And it's just so simple and it's got a similar applicator as the Strength and Length Mascara, and it's just truly incredible. So there you have it. This is the look. Really simple, really easy. If I wasn't wearing a mask, I could put a lip on and some blush. If I am wearing a mask, like I'm going to today, then this is just a really simple way to enjoy a really fresh eye. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? 
it's just so easy and simple and you look alive and awake and like you put some some really good effort into your skin so i hope you guys enjoyed that please feel free to tag me at dendal at bare minerals can't wait to see your guys's looks and i hope you enjoyed all those beautiful products